Hi, here we will discuss the example for inheritance concept. The question is given here. We have to construct the following hierarchy. The hierarchy is here. Uh, this is the stack holder class. Uh, this one is having the children, faculty class, student class, and uh, researchers class. So here, uh, the stack stack holder class should have variables ID and name. So based upon that, we are uh, creating the class name stack holder and declaring the two variables ID and name. Then uh, for this, we have to set the values. For, uh, for this, I am using the set underscore id method and set underscore id name. So through this, I am assigning the values uh, by calling this methods uh, from the main method, main I mean driver class, driver class university. So here I am using the main method. So wherever main method is available, that class is called driver class. So inside that, I am uh, creating the object in for getting the input using the scanner class then here i am uh, getting the input uh, for the stack holder s name uh, string data type so here this is the method to get the string input and stack holder id uh, that will be a integer data type so variable is created at sid so the next int is the method to get the integer input then i am creating the object for stakeholder and I am calling the two methods set underscore id set underscore name through this I am assigning the values to this two variables then I am calling the method print to uh, print the name and id of the stakeholder that is uh, calling here by using the object variable yes okay then uh, based upon the uh, second uh, statement the derived classes to be uh, created here based upon the given hierarchy here derived classes are faculty student and researchers so these three classes should have two variables position underscore id position underscore title so based upon that first i am creating the faculty class this is child to the stakeholder class so faculty class created this is the extension of the stakeholder that means this is child class and the stakeholder is the parent class as per this hierarchy structure then two variables position id and position title are created uh, id is integer data type title is string data type then here i am calling the set method for both id and uh, title so after uh, say, uh, after this here uh, that the title and uh, in, uh, id to be set by calling the method uh, from the driver class by creating the object small f then uh, i am uh, calling the dis display method to print the values of that uh, uh, faculty details then uh, as per this statement uh, hierarchy i am going to create the second one is student this is the child class for the uh, stakeholder parent then as per the statement position id position title two variables created for that we are assigning the values by using set underscore sid set underscore s title these two methods are called uh, here inside the student uh, uh, portion so here the student position id integer variable and uh, uh, the student position title here string variable so methods respective methods are used to get the input then object s is created here for the class student then using that object we are calling the method set underscore sid set underscore s title after assigning those values here uh, after assigning those values here just we have to display the values by using the method display here i have created the object student uh, yes so yes the display is uh, calling the method to display the details of student then as per the statement third class sub uh, child class is researchers so researcher uh, child class is created with respect to the parent stakeholder same two variables to be uh, uh, declared here with respect to its data type then based upon this here setting the values for id and title so here it is uh, yeah our title so based upon this 
uh, here i have to pass the values uh, researcher position id integer uh, method uh, and position title string so string data type input method then i am creating the uh, object r with respect to the class researcher then by using that object r i am calling the set method for id set method for title so after assigning those values then i have to display those values by using the uh display method so by using the object r so based upon that these values will be displayed so uh, here the st uh, stakeholders uh, researcher faculty and student both are i3 uh, three are uh, uh, child class to the parent class based upon that here inputs given uh, here until uh, here the inputs are given so those details are just displayed just as per the statement here we have to create the uh, stakeholder class with two variables id and name here position id and position title all classes should have the print statements print method to display the details okay so to display the details we are using the display method or print method so in three children method children classes i have used the display method to print the details but in stakeholder class i have used the print method that's that's not a problem you can use uh, any method name to display the details after that here uh, the university is the uh, driver class name which is given to create all the objects so already i have explained so here university is the class where we are uh, using to create the objects for all other subclasses okay so uh, based upon the statements we have done the uh, uh, execution of this program and got the output as per the printing all the objects here thanks for watching